Hi, this is David from Espresso Tech. In this video, I'm going to show you the control system for the Rocket R58 dual boiler espresso machine. So, this little box, as you can see here with the display, plugs directly into the brain of the R58. I can now access the controls of this machine. So, quite a few different little things you can do with it. Everything from changing the language, the temperature, to the water supply source. So, first thing you do, hold this button off to the right to get into the programming. Now I can get into the language, I can get into the water source, go between the direct water connection or use the reservoir or the water tank. Um, all of this can be accessed through the menu, it's all done electronically, digitally as well. Um, I can go into the service boiler so I can turn it on or off, let's say for any particular reason I want to turn it off, conserve power if I'm not going to use the steam function or hot water. I can now go into the temperature. I can change the unit between centigrade or Fahrenheit. I can change the brew boiler temperature. The brew boiler is for your coffee out of the brew head. It goes from 95 to 115 degrees Celsius. Um, I can now go into the service boiler temperature. Now that is for your steam and your hot water. The range for this is 109 to 128 degrees centigrade. Um, so pretty much there are limited controls in it. I'll show you one more time because it times out after a while. I can change through the different languages, the water source. I can turn on or off the service boiler. I can change the unit of temperature, Fahrenheit or Celsius. I can change the brew boiler temperature. I can dial it in exactly like, a, like the espresso, exactly how much steam I want, how much pressure with the service boiler temperature, and then back to the standard brew boiler. So this now will actually be the readout of what the boiler temperature is at. So I can run through the water there, and if I were to adjust it, if you see, it starts to lower in the temperature a little bit as I've had it on for a while. So you can actually see what you're brewing at while you're brewing. Thanks a lot for watching this video. Um, I will bring as many technical videos as we can to you on all the machines. So stay tuned.